Hello everyone, welcome back to Math Mode. Today we have an interesting algebra problem with radicals, with powers. We have square root of difference of square, so we have 100 square minus 36 square. And right here we have two options. So right now pause the video and write your suggestion, write your option in a comment. So let's try to solve it. Take a look. First of all, we have difference of squares. So we need to know the formula because if we have a square minus b square, we can write it as a minus b and times a plus b. So this is our formula and moreover we have difference of squares in our radical sign. So we have this is our a, this is our b and we can use this formula. What we will have? In parentheses we will have difference and the sum. So difference 100 minus 36 and the sum 100 plus 36. So as you can see we can rewrite these using this formula. What are we going to do next? Let's find all of these numbers. So if we find this 100 minus 36, we will have 64 and times 136. So this is our expression after this simplifying step. And as you can see, we can easily find this square root because we all know that square root of 64 equal to 8. And we can rewrite this using the formula. If we have square root of a times b, we can rewrite this as a square root of a times square root of b. This is a really good rule and we use this rule right here. We have a product and we have this is our a, this is our b. So we'll have square root of 64 times square root of 136. So as you can see, square root of 64 equal to 8 and this square root of 136, we, can, we need to factor it and we need to find the answer. The best way to factor out this 136 is to write this as 4 times 34. And as you can see, if we use this rule once more right here, we will have 8 times square root of 4 and times square root of 34. From here, as you can see, square root of 4 equal to 2. And if you multiply this by 8, we'll have 16. 16 square root of 34. Of course, we can rewrite this 34 as 2 times 17, but it's not necessary because this, this expression doesn't give us any, any good answer. So this is our, our final answer. If you still have any question, write a question in the comment, write a suggestion in the comment. Thank you for watching and see you in the next videos.